What's up, y'all? Welcome back to my channel, Life as Tisha Marie. So today I'm gonna hit you guys with a recipe. I'm gonna do collard greens in a crock pot. Um, I do wanna shout out smoking and grilling with AB because this is where I got the recipe and I did it for the first time last year for um, Thanksgiving and it was so freaking good. So um, there are a couple things that I had to kind of switch up because I don't have it, like um, red pepper flakes and hot sauce, stuff, things like that. But before we get into the video, please hit the like button, comment down below if you're new so I know, and subscribe to the channel, all right? Let's get straight into this video. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and go over what you're gonna need. Um, I actually wanted smoked turkey necks. They didn't have smoked turkey necks, so I just went ahead and got smoked turkey wings. It's still gonna be tasty and delicious, so I got that. You're gonna need um, a bell pepper, a whole onion, um, vinegar. If you don't have vinegar, you can also use um, cider, apple cider vinegar. And I have some chicken broth right here. I also have some minced garlic. I have some pepper, garlic powder, onion powder, some seasoned salt, and of course I have the big bag of greens. Um, you don't have to get the bag, you can go ahead and clean your own greens and shred them up, do, you know, do what you do, but this is what I'm gonna use. And then of course you need a crock pot. So I got my handy dandy crock pot right here. Um, we're gonna go ahead and get straight into the video. Like I said, I normally would have red pepper flakes. I don't have any, or and I don't have hot sauce either, but it's okay, the recipe will still do what the do, okay? Let's get straight into the video. Okay, you guys, so I got the crock pot plugged in. Um, the first thing you're gonna do is get your smoked meat, whatever you choose to get, and go ahead and put that in the bottom of your crock pot. So here's the wings, they are humongous. Okay, and then I cut up the one bell pepper and the one onion, so it's right here. And you're gonna go ahead and just put that in there. You don't have to use bell pepper, that's very optional. Um, you can use jalapeno, you know, whatever. I actually would've used jalapeno if I had it, just because I don't have the red pepper flakes, but. And then you're gonna need eight cups of water or chicken broth or a mixture of both. So I have my one cup right here, so I'll be pouring eight times. I'm gonna open my chicken broth. So here's one cup. And here goes another cup. Let's see. Two. Four. So I was right, I needed two. Five. Six, really, yeah, six. And then seven. And then eight. And add a little bit more, because I don't know if that was exactly eight. Okay, after that, go ahead and put the top on it. Oh, matter of fact, before you put the top, go ahead and add your minced garlic. I'm gonna go ahead and add the rest that I have in here. Gotta get some more of that. Okay. Then you're gonna go ahead and put the top, put it on high for six hours. So that's, it's on high, it's gonna cook for six hours, but um, after four hours, we're gonna add the meat and do all the other stuff. So I'll be back after four hours of letting this cook, and then we'll go on with the recipe, okay, you guys? So stay tuned. If you're still here watching, thank you so much. Hit the like button and comment down below. Subscribe. Uh, let me know if you guys ever did crop or crop pot recipe for your collard greens, because when I saw 
uh, him do that, I was like, in the crock pot? But it, trust the process, y'all. It's really good. All right, I'll be back, y'all, after four hours. Okay, you guys, so it's been four hours, and the meat, the onions, and the bell peppers, and the garlic have been doing the same. The meat is literally falling off. Not all the way off, but some parts of the turkey wings are falling off. So this is what it's gonna look like after four hours. I have some greens right here. It is two pounds. That bag I showed y'all was a two pound bag. So I went ahead and rinsed them out. I try to get as many stems um, you know, out that I don't want. So all you're gonna do, rinse them off, get all the dirty, nasty looking ones out, and just start adding your greens. So this is two pounds. I'm gonna do little by little, so that way I can get some down in, in the uh, broth. Get the rest. We're gonna season this up, y'all, too. Yes, yeah, I couldn't get every single stem, unfortunately, but it's okay. Stems don't really bother me. We're gonna add our seasoning. Okay, I'm recording though, thank you. <laughs> all right, y'all. So I'm basically just trying to get them all in the broth <clears throat> as much as I can. And like, I know it seems like it's a lot, but it's gonna welt down as it cooks, so. Not that big of a deal. Okay, so that's good. And move that out my way. I guess I could try to fit this. This is it right here. There we go. <clears throat> that's it. From here, you're gonna go ahead and do whoop, your onion powder. You want seasoned green, so. Okay. As the meat falls off the wings, it'll be more space to move and push around. Then we're gonna do, um, where's my garlic? Let me grab my garlic powder. Yeah. Oh, I thought we had an open one already. Okay. Go in with some garlic. Oh, none of my seasonings are open. All right. This is garlic now. Okay. I'm gonna put a little paprika. Pepper. Like I said, if I had hot sauce, that would be going in. So pepper and some vinegar. I don't really measure, I just, I just know. Okay. As this cook, oh, it's seasoned salt, I'm sorry. As this cooks down, you can start tasting you know, once it's cooked down a bit, and you'll know what you need. It's like if you need more salt. So this is seasoned salt. Okay. Same thing. So that's really it, you guys. Um, gonna cook for about two hours maybe two and a half and I'm gonna show you guys the end result I cannot wait because all the meats will be coming off that those wings and it's gonna be so good it's gonna look way different y'all so 
you ready all right don't forget to hit the like button comment down below subscribe if you're new to the channel okay you guys so i hit that six hour mark so i'm gonna go ahead and open this up Woo! that looks good take my spoon oh the turkey oh look at that so here's the wing the meat's coming off of it you can see that oh my god here's the other wing right here i'm trying to lift it look at that meat oh y'all i don't really like mushy greens so this is actually perfect as far as my greens how i want them to look looks so good i did um add a little bit more seasoned salt you guys and some uh onion powder and taste uh, oh my god it was good so good so this is the crock pot recipe it is delicious now if you want to if you want it like this is not the way you want yours to look and you want it a little more softer i would say leave it in the crock pot on high for 30 more minutes but this is what i like this is what i like right here so i'm just gonna let it rest in here for a minute on low and i'm gonna tear this up y'all i really hope you guys enjoyed this quick recipe um very easy very delicious don't forget to hit the like button of course don't forget to comment down below and also hit the subscribe button if you're new for more videos okay blessings to you all until next time it's your girl tisha marie bye